Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and today I am very very excited because I'm here with another yet another shoe collection video and they are my Giuseppe Zanotti uh, shoe collection some I've had for years others are fairly new but they're here with me all 15 of them this is interesting guys I did not know I had 15 pairs of Zanotti heels so first up guys I am going to share with you this gorgeous pair now when did I buy this pair no Ali bought this pair for me like he does so many of my shoes I think this is about I think six years old and that is why I don't know what they're called do you guys know what these are called these are gorgeous they are just black patterns uh, they have this sexy what is this called guys the cage like feature what is this called on the back of your ankle and then I love this because they're so understated. I wore these for my, was it my 30th birthday party? I don't even remember. Uh, and they looked so, so sexy. Oh my God. So these are them in black. Very, very good to go and walk around in, really. Next, guys, are the cruel sandals. Oh my God. The Giuseppe's and Notice collection of these. I think they're iconic. These were inspired by Kanye West. I think I said this in a haul video. And I bought these in London, so do check out this haul right above here. And these are inspired, like I said, by Kanye West. So guys, these are nude. They are stunning. They're patterned. I haven't worn them enough. I haven't done enough justice to these, but these are iconic by Giuseppe Zanotti. And they also do a really nice black one and a gold one, which I'm eyeing. Or actually, there's one even that's embellished right now. So that one is one I'm eyeing. They have this uh, petals or leaves rather that uh, frame the whole foot to the ankle and then they have the signature sleek heels. So that's another one by Zanotti. I'm wearing a size 36 in these. Next guys are the very famous, extremely famous that I have four of them. These are the Harmony sandals guys. These are in silver. I love the simplicity of the Harmony sandal. I love that it comes featured with three straps that run from side to side across the foot. And the best thing about these shoes are that they can transition all around the year or all through the year, all seasons. You can wear them for spring, summer, autumn, uh, not really winter, but if you're indoors, why not? Or the coat on, I would definitely wear these. And they're very comfortable. This rose gold was my first pair ever, you can tell. The proof is the wear right here and my toe that has scratched the color off. Anyway, these are my favorite. Then I got the silver ones. And then these are black, guys. Oh, stunning. You guys look at these and how I wear them in my first ever video right here. Black, sexy shoe lookbook. I think they were there. They should have been. I had a fractured toe. A fractured toe. And I actually filmed that whole shot that whole video walking around in those gorgeous sexy shoes and people are very much like me and Ali people have a shoe fetish guys I didn't believe it but people really do have a shoe fetish and here is a nude pair that I got after the two these are recent buys guys and I don't even think they've been in my closet for a year but they are amazing and I do believe the harmony sandal comes now in a winter collection which has fur on these so yes there is a winter collection look it up they've just launched yes they have they're the same but they have fur right here geez i need those so these are a must have if you have to have one pair of shoe from giuseppe zanotti guys next up are these gorgeous giuseppe zanotti i feel like every time i say giuseppe zeppi zeppi it's like a tongue twister these gorgeous laser cut beauties and these featured in my first ever fashion video here on youtube a year ago check it out here it was my sexy black shoe lookbook the one i keep telling you guys that ali is like all over all the time i think ali has given me about twenty thousand views on that video no jokes anyway so these are them and I, I don't know why i haven't worn these enough i think the only time i wore them is for that video no kidding if you notice giuseppe zanotti does a lot of shoes with the ankle zip ups most of them actually i want to slip these on right now and and another thing i notice right now is that um i don't know what this is it's leather but it's quite it's quite sturdy so it kind of just sits on your foot it's not that soft 
leather so yeah that's these next up guys you guys saw this in my london haul if you haven't check it right here oh my god when jennifer lopez guys collaborated with zanotti i was dying i was stalking zanotti all over the world every social media page Jennifer Lopez guys she was she did uh, another shoe with them that was this bling shoe and I remember receiving one whatsapp chat from someone who's in this room right now saying get this sono get this sono and I looked at them oh my god were those shoes pricey they were not so much my style but they were gorgeous anyway I had to get one pair from the collection and they were these gorgeous blue Jennifer Lopez it says right there yeah they're blue they're suede no they're velvet and then again all the great details the stripy toe open toe box sorry the stripes all around it so these are really really stunning guys and i think also iconic for zanotti because of jlo next guys meet these they call the carry sandal they're embellished in crystals oh my god i thought i'll wear these for my birthday but then i was debating between my love of christian lubuta and zanotti and then i picked that on but oh my god these but then ali's birthday is coming up so i may wear these i don't know he likes these shoes a lot they're very sexy sandals in suede in a blush suede actually and i featured these in my 100 days of heels campaign where i wore a pair of heels for 100 days one each day for 100 days and yeah you can follow me on instagram to check those out and these featured in there and these were day 100 oh my god and they are amazing these shoes are pricey i kid you not but i mean they like cinderella just call me cinderella so guys <laughs> i was thinking of a really weird thing right now but anyway these shoes remind me of cinderella oh my god modern day cinderella shoes and i'm eyeing one by jimmy choo have you guys seen the cinderella shoes by jimmy choo if you have let me know in the comment section below and hopefully i should have them very soon i love love the shoes you guys check them out just go on instagram and just search look at jimmy choo you'll see them coming back to zanotti heels and i don't know the name of this sandal i think they're called a the sophie and if you guys know the name then help me out here uh these are a beautiful metallic shoe with uh, a lot of ankle detail right here and a toe box similar to the harmony toe but uh the twist here is i don't know if this shoe is silver or gold to be honest it's it's both what do you call a silver and a gold huh gilbert is it <laughs> gilbert <laughs> okay we'll just kind of invent to that silver 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 Silver, oh, I don't okay. know. <laughs> Silver plus gold. <laughs> okay, guys. So these shoes are very different from all the rest because they are not silver and they are not gold. They are what do you call silver and gold? <laughs> these are not silver. They are not gold. They are in between, and I love them. Or they are like you know those. When I was a little girl, we did those funny things, those rubbing, and then we would put it like this and. they would do those funny what are they called you know it <laughs> oh shit <laughs> you don't know those paper things you scratch and then you get they like they change color or like those compass sets you never had those compass sets that change color i am having the oxford compass set this is like i'm really such a studious person that's all you can talk about oxford could you what were you thinking <laughs> <laughs> no those yeah. like pinky ones just with the zippers not Oh yeah yeah. Yeah, the pen set, oh, yeah, the pencil the holders. Mine even had like those dots the fish swim yes. like those water ones. Okay guys, so I was saying these shoes are neither a silver nor a gold. Uh there's something in between or actually they have It's very different. I don't know what to say. They're really nice and metallic and shiny. A very good investment. Oh my god, guys, this would make nice wedding shoes. Yeah, these would make really nice wedding shoes. Up next guys are these gorgeous very recent very new uh to Sonotti right now and very hot and trending they are the Miss Unfinished they are in a 
hot hot fuchsia hot pink color very neon these are so so cute guys they are pricey probably my most could i say most no these and the carry sandals the one i showed you the embellished ones have to be the most expensive in this collection don't be fooled by the shape of it right here they're like almost like a wedge they're very very comfy and they're true to size i'm wearing a 36. i bought these while i was in dubai you can watch my dubai haul video right here and i also model these for you guys in my gucci uh, belt pairings video or how i wear a gucci belt and oh my god these shoes are just to die for i feel like eating this color and this is like a really in your face wow let me stop unfinished extra this is what they are okay guys these look really nice for this dress won't you agree i think i'm going to wear these and take a picture these are my first ever giuseppe's and naughty pairs of shoes and you can tell they have lasted so long and these are super super sexy they are slingback patent uh black strap toe and then uh what is this a blue sole a royal blue sole and i believe these also come in a satin finish but mine are the leather patent and these are a size 35 so yeah those are the beautiful sling bags okay next guys are these gorgeous pair and again i don't know why i don't wear these enough they're a bit on the wild side i think i know why i don't wear these enough because i don't know there's something now, don't get me wrong, these shoes are very comfortable and this is real something. It's just lamb skin, I think, not lamb. Goat skin? Okay, no skin, let's just talk about it. It's definitely not leopard skin, real, no. If you notice very closely, guys, the heel dips from under and then extends out. Like, it's not beginning here, it's, I don't know, it's, it's a little bit weird. The silhouette is fine all around here and then got a really cute little toe box so your big toe can peep through but there's something i don't particularly love i don't know i've not seen many people wearing leopard print shoes they used to be really on trend uh, a few years ago when i got these yeah leopard print you have to be very picky because leopard print some people do some really bad looking leopard print is this a leopard is this a leopard <laughs> So guys, there was an article I was reading where the author said, uh, Giuseppe is a naughty knows what women want and women want a leopard. Leopard print shoes at least for me. And yeah, this is actually making me feel like I need to start rocking some leopard print really, really soon. Next up guys are these, I don't know what these are to be honest, I forget the name. If you guys know the name, let me know. I remember buying these. When I saw them, I was so drawn to them because of uh, all the metal, heavy metal detail on the shoe. And then it's a very, very cute little shoe. It looks small but fierce. They're very different. I think this is not the best from Giuseppe Zanotti, but it's different. So I have it. And the studs are very different from what they do now. And especially this heel, guys. I mean, what is this? It's just odd. I like that this shoe can really dress up a plain outfit and it's it's just very edgy. It's got a lot of character. I'm not a fan of the heel, the silver just half pointy kind of heel, but I, I can I can live with these. I, I can definitely dress them up or down. So guys, last but not least are these. Oh my god, and these are also a pair I've had for a long time. And I can't seem to part ways. I cannot sell this. Look at this shoe. I'm so sorry, but they scream everything bondage and... <sighs> they are called the buckled cage something sandal. Oh my God. And there's also another version of this shoe, guys. Uh, you get the same shoe with the buckles coming all the way up to your calf. Those are also pretty sexy, but I like these. I like how the buckles and the straps go all around to cover the heel as if it's like holding the heel all together, but this shoe, I mean, the craftsmanship of this shoe is amazing. You guys can see that. And they're very comfortable. Again, they are similar to the Harmony. I feel like the Harmony was born from some of these pairs because if you notice, the toe boxes are the same and then the straps got really slender and slimmer. And these are so unique, wow. 
So guys, these are all the members of my Giuseppe Zanotti uh, little family. I love them all. I don't think I have any pair that does not appeal to me. And I really hope you enjoyed this video, guys. If you did, share and subscribe and like and comment down in the comment section below. And until I see you in the next one, lots of love and light.